Hi grade twos, today for spelling we are looking at segmenting our words into their phonemes or into their sounds. Now the reason why this is super important for your spelling and becoming a really good speller is because it helps you to listen very carefully to each of the sounds in the words. Because sometimes when we say words fast, we can tend to skip out sounds and that means that when we come to do our writing we are missing letters and sounds from our words so we're looking at them very slowly and we're looking at saying them we're looking at writing them and we're looking at breaking them down into their phonemes or into their blends so that we can understand better what sounds are in words to help us spell so our activity today looks at the words looked called asked laughed thought through different because of work and water. Now it's really important that you don't skip over the talking bit because that's helping us to learn to spell. So what I would like you to do is it says to tap, say and read, which means that if you're going to print it out, you can tap, otherwise you can just say and read. But it's asking you to break down the sounds with this dot and lines underneath. Now, if it's a dot, that means that it's a single sound. So there's one letter, so one grapheme for each phoneme, which is each sound. So one letter makes one sound. If you've got like a blended grapheme here, like these double O we know makes an OO sound, we're going to say that together. We're going to do that blend. We know K is K, it's an individual sound, but we know ED blends together to make ED. So I want you to say it to yourself. L, U, K, K, D. Then say the whole word looked. In this box here, it asks you to break it down just like it has in the first box. And that's really good practice for breaking down phonemes. Now, it's going to be tricky to do some typing in that box, but you could set it out this way where you do a little dash in between for me. So you can do looked dash. I know that's L on its own. I know ooh, makes a double O sound. There's another break to the K and another break to the ED, which makes ED. So you can set it out like that, or you could do dots in between for me. So you could go k makes the sound, ah makes the sound, all oh, makes the sound together, and then ed on the end makes ed again. So you can either do lines for me, or you can do dot points, whatever's easier for you when you're on your iPad or on your computer. So that's going to happen in this box here. So you've had a practice saying the breakdown of the phonemes. You've had a practice of saying the whole word. You've had a practice of writing the breakdown of the phonemes. You read it to yourself. Then you're going to cover either with your hand or with a book. You're going to cover that word. And then you're going to have a go of spelling it yourself without looking at the word. Have a go. Give it a tick if it was right. You're going to do all of these words breaking them down into their phonemes first, saying the whole word, having a go at breaking down the phonemes yourself, saying the whole word, practice spelling it, give it a tick if you were correct.